Good morning, this is Simon Bell from Stone Town Conservatives and we're just off our high street in Westbridge Park. Now a lot of you will know about the changes to M&S parking and the success, the enormous success of M&S and people wanting to shop at Westbridge Park in M&S um, is quite exceptional and having spoken to some of the managers their their figures and their their budgets have been absolutely smashed so thanks thank you everybody who's helping our high street and visiting M&S as a destination now we just um, indicated that there's going to be a change to parking um, and um, I have with me Val from Stone Town Conservatives and Val's just going to explain to some people who might have found it a little bit difficult exactly what is going to happen. Good morning Val. Good morning. Right, I think this takes place next week. I believe so, yes. Okay. Um, I think really when everything's opening up more, um, and I presume the parking will then become worse and so they're, they're sort of focusing that time, on that time. The whole point, as far as I can see, is no money needs to be used. You don't have to come and pay for parking. You purely have to spend £5 in the shop at some point in your two-hour parking slot. There is also 15 minutes free, so if you just want to dash in and get a butty, you don't even need to do that. And, and that's the important word. Um, uh, um, Val because this is still free parking. It's still free parking. All that anybody has to do is make sure they pick up a voucher. But I've just talked to the young lady in the shop. You will be prompted. Do you need a voucher for your parking? So yeah. that, that's absolutely brilliant Val because if people are prompted, especially maybe some of our elder uh, yep. sort of um, uh, folk, um, just to remind them and say please don't forget so they're not trying to make this is about providing a service to our community. Yeah. Now the other thing um, that has been said to me by my own daughter, I don't like the idea of touching a screen but I just checked as you come out of the shop okay. there is actually a um, hand sanitizer. Brilliant. I have asked whether they will be able to provide hand sanitizers. She doesn't know at this stage, but hopefully they will. There is a gentleman who's going to be here. He's here at the moment. Here he is. And he Here's our guy that's helping us. <laughs> in order to help people get used to it. So he's here right the way up until Christmas Absolutely. Eve. Absolutely. There will be somebody here to help out if you're not sure. Okay. Um, and if like me, you every so often forget your um, car registration number it would be great to help you learn <laughs> yes <laughs> and I think the other thing Val is um, quite a lot of people come and do their weekly shop or even drop-in shop but then <coughs> they might be taking their children across to the gym to swimming the or the hall. gym or whatever you can still do that all you have to do is come in and do a little shop perhaps while they're there I mean if they're at the far end of the swimming pool you can't see them anyway no. You okay. can't sit down in the leisure centre now, so, you know, rather than stand up for half an hour watching <coughs> your children, just come and do your shopping. Absolutely. So instead of some of the negative and the naysayers, yeah. actually this is a positive thing Absolutely. for our community in Stone. Yeah. And I can still go and get my prescription or pop to see Nick the butcher. Um, I can do all of that and still, right. as long as I do my sh some shopping here after minimum of five pounds but then i don't think i've ever spent less than five pounds brilliant in okay so so here we are free parking at m and yeah just understand the rules and you'll be helped absolutely, and prompted absolutely but there's plenty of helps and prompts that will be there for you okay and we wish everybody a very happy christmas we certainly do <laughs> val thanks Thank very you. much indeed